Well, now at six. Look at this, a fire and explosion highlight the homeless crisis in Venice. It is a problem that's only getting worse along the boardwalk. Good evening, everyone. I'm Pat Harvey. Residents say they are fed up with how bad things have gotten. Everything from fires to violent attacks. The city says it's trying to fix the problem. And CBS 2's Lori Paris is there live with more. Lori? Pat, this situation is so heated. It is getting so distressing. The locals we spoke with insisted on remaining anonymous out of fear of retaliation. A frightening fire and explosion at the encampment on the Venice boardwalk. Not the first time, and this time witnesses say they saw a man throw something into the tent before it erupted twice, nearly injuring three people standing nearby. So we have complete lawlessness here in Venice. This man's home security camera has captured a year, he says, of mayhem. A building fire a block away and tent fire after tent fire. And we've also had armed robbery right outside of our window of a parking lot attendant. Um, I've seen young girls go and trade their shoes for God knows what at tents. It's an understatement to say locals are fed up. Brian Averill is on the Venice Neighborhood Council. I mean, I don't know if you've walked the boardwalk recently, but it's, it's like a third world country at this point. He says he's encouraged by recent cooperation between the county and city to prioritize getting the people on the boardwalk into housing. But he says it needs to happen quickly as the economy opens up and crowds return to an oceanfront now occupied by the unhoused. Horrible things are going to happen. And I, I don't mean to fear monger. That's just from being out there all the time. Uh, and not wanting to see this happen. Councilman Mike Bonnet points to a new LAFD fast response unit, a new LAPD car dedicated to the oceanfront walk, and several housing projects opening up and in the works. People just don't buy it anymore, frankly. Well, I mean, if, if, you're, if you're dealing with the, the, the negative consequences of encampments, there's two ways to deal with this, right? Uh, uh, arrest those who are committing crimes, uh, uh, whether, whether it's robbery or arson or anything else, arrest them. But the, the core issue, the one that, 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 that I have the power to do something about, is try to bring resources to get people off the street. Uh, and we have been getting lots of people off the street, but people are becoming homeless even faster than we're housing them. And he says he knows they are not doing nearly enough. He insists more help is on the way soon. We are live in Venice. I'm Lori Perez. Pat, back to you. All right. Thanks so much, Lori.